It's day four of our eighth annual OMS Gives Back grocery giveaway. Today I'm joined with the great folks from Rose of Durham uh, Dur and Catholic Family Services. Uh, really excited to have you guys with us today. So are you ready Take to us. roll? Take All us. Right, We're well, ready let's to roll. Go. Okay. As we found out so far this week with the, the three groups that have been through so yep. far, um, Feed the Need mentioned yesterday that uh, registrations into the charitable network in Durham Region is up 52% on their hunger report. Well, we're noticing our numbers are steady. We service up to about 300 families a year. Um, we average about 10 to 12 intakes a month. Mm -hmm. uh, these are brand new people to us. And, uh, and what we're noticing are two things. One, the clients that are coming to us are coming with more high needs, more complex cases. They're unsheltered, they're underhoused, they don't have enough money to make ends right. meet. They uh, are trying to raise a child in an economy that their, their uh, checks haven't gone up. Like they have not had an extra penny, but uh, the inflation rate is huge. Uh, so a lot of times you asked me, do we need the, sh the shampoo and the body wash? Yeah. And I went, yeah, because if you have to buy a diaper or formula or shampoo, you're going to buy your diapers and formula. And a lot of our young moms and dads, they're really, really good parents. And they put their children's needs over their own. We provide, I think you heard Deneen say, oh, me, uh, frozen meals, because we provide a hot lunch in our school program, and we provide snacks in all of our programs. And the snack used to be a, a small snack to get them through till they get home. Now that snack may be their only meal of the day. I like to say we build babies' brains. Yeah. So what we do is all of our work, whether it's a social program or intensive counseling, attachment, all of our work is attachment-based. So we're trying to really, really, really build mm -hmm. um, the baby's brain to attach to a loved one, to their champion. Everyone needs a champion. Right. Um, so mom and dad are the champions. And sometimes they've never had a champion. So they don't know what it means. They don't know how to do that. So we do some intensive work, l giving them the confidence, giving them the skills. Well, let's go see where how everyone's doing and yeah. we'll, uh, we'll get caught up. I We've think got... that's all mine. Look at that. I see arrowroot oh, cookies. Oh, wow. That's great. Okay. I hope. We've cashed out $7,852.63. Oh, wow. <laughs> I am speechless. I, am, uh, I don't know what to say. That is so generous and so incredible. Uh, wow. <laughs> so we're going <laughs> to, in the, in the, in fairness for everything that's gone on so far this week we're going to round you up to nine thousand oh. dollars so. <laughs> okay <laughs> thank you <laughs> you're very welcome that touches our hearts so much because we are not funded for any of this and it is such a need for our young families and uh being able to do this for them um, on behalf of all of them. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Um, our little ones know about this yeah. and they decided that they wanted to contribute in some way. So they made this for you. Thank you guys very much for everything that you guys do. It's uh, just critical work in our community and I, I can't over stated enough how important it is so thank you for that and um, um, we're honored to do this work like that's how we all feel we all are honored to work with these families and these babies and these moms they're so courageous and I am in awe of them every single day